Tonight, this young man is sharing his story about Officer Gallinger. He met Nicholas Gallinger in a chance encounter just two days before he was tragically killed. Kayla Strayer shows us why that meeting will stick with this young man for the rest of his life. Kayla. Yeah, during the funeral today, Officer Gallinger's father and brother shared stories of how proud they are to hear about the impact that Officer Gallinger had here in Chattanooga. One of those encounters actually happened behind me at the police services building. It was with a little boy as he was taking a tour here. He tells me it was very inspiring for him, but now he's heartbroken after hearing what happened to the nice man he met here last week. Nine-year-old Jason Snyder wants to be a police officer when he grows up. Because they're nice and, and they help people. Last week, his mom Carrie took the family on a tour of the police services building. The officer that we met gave us the tour of the building and we got to meet like several officers that day. One of the officers they met just happened to be Officer Nicholas Gallinger. He was really nice. We actually met him when he was walking down a hallway and he was carrying some papers and he stopped what he was doing to speak with the kids. I told him how hard is it to be a police officer? What did he say? He said it's not that hard. Days later, Carrie says her son saw Officer Gallinger on the news as the man who was hit while working on Hamill Road. Sad. Jason immediately recognized Officer Gallinger as the nice man who wished him well with his dream. He told me good luck. I want to share another story with you of the type of officer that Gallinger was during his one month on the force. This is from a Facebook post from George Randall. He said that Officer Gallinger was actually working the scene of a, an accident that his nephew was involved in one week ago. Randall says he was very impressed with the officer's willingness to share his personal experiences with his nephew and also how much he genuinely cared about helping people during their time of need. He said that kindness is going to stay with them for the rest of their lives. Reporting in Chattanooga, Kayla Strayer, News Channel 9. Kayla, an impact that reached across the city in a short time. Thank you so much.